Okay, so principle seven is don't practice, just jam. So jamming is one of the best activities we can have as musicians when we're developing our musicianship. And if you look at natural language learning, that's exactly how we learn. We don't learn by exercises and, and studying and practicing. We just listen and then we jam with our family or with our parents and other people around us and we learn our language easily and quickly. So we want to apply this lesson to music and use jamming as the cornerstone of our musical education. What is jamming exactly? Well, it's just basically getting together with other people and having an improvised musical conversation. We shouldn't have too much of a plan. We shouldn't have any music in front of us. It should just be us and our instruments listening and responding appropriately and fitting in together and staying in the groove together with our fellow musicians. Jamming, in my opinion, is the single most useful thing we can do to develop our musicianship. So I encourage that it should be the cornerstone practice of young or developing musicians. So to jam, it's very simple, just to get together with some friends, take some instruments, and play together. It's important to just keep it simple and make more of a priority playing together than doing some individually brilliant things or even being extra creative. It's more at the beginning good to just be solid and together and feel the music together and really fit in. Uh, it's also good to jam with good musicians, like the best musicians you can get to agree to jam with you. You should jam with them as much as you can. Think about when you're a kid, you're learning from expert speakers like your parents. They're already fluent in the language. So uh, if we always are just jamming and learning from young or developing musicians, then we will, of course, develop, but it will take us longer. Imagine a bunch of kids in a room together learning their language from each other. It would take a longer time. So find whoever you can that will let you jam with them and ask nicely and see if these good musicians will let you jam with them and they won't mind as long as you keep it simple and stay in the groove they will enjoy jamming with you also okay so next we've got some uh, we got some instructions about how to jam and a video demonstration of a typical beginning kind of jam session <laughs> 